Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may now be seated. Good morning, Washington. This is Riley. Did you know that one pint of blood could save three lives? Well, Miss Kinsella sure did. And here's some of her seventh hour kids talking about the blood drive. Hello, my name is Terry, and I'm here with Mackenzie Vane, and we are here to talk about what's happening on May 14th. What's happening on May 14th is a blood drive here at Washington from 2.30 to 6.30. But hurry, we are only, we are only at 7.30 people or less. If you help donate, you are helping people out. So please come. You are never too busy to donate, and it's quick and easy. Come to donate and save a life. And if you come, you get some free snacks. And who wouldn't like that? Also, if you come, please say 7 Hour brought you here. If you're a student at Washington, please ask your parents, neighbors, or anyone. Well, let's see DK and his views. Today we are interviewing Mrs. Kinsella. She is the science teacher whose room is 234. Well, Mrs. Kinsella, I have a question for you. Go ahead. How do you donate to the blow drive? How do you donate to the blood drive? Yeah. Um, we just need to sign up on the website for the Blood Center Wisconsin. It's www.bcw.edu backslash Washington, and you can pick up one of the donor slots. Don't forget, when you comment, you also need to put 7th hour on it. And, okay, another question. Um, how does it feel to donate? Um, it's pretty easy. I've, I've donated for many years. Um, just a pink prick in your finger to start with for them to find out if you're eligible to donate or not and then um, uh, obviously the needle to, to get put in your arm to be able to donate the blood but it's just a you know, little little prick but it's, um, the the benefits of it far outweigh the little bit of pain that, that goes into it so okay. it makes you feel really good about yourself. Why don't you allow the viewers know why you can't donate to your blood uh, Well I donated over spring break and my next time to be eligible to donate is the second week of June so I've already signed up to donate at that time but your body needs to take some time to get back into that level of homeostasis or balance, um, so I'm not eligible for this drive. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Donate. Thanks for that helpful information, guys. Now, this Monday, May 12th, after school, from 3 to 5 in the library, will be a, a song written and played by three students. Also, after their song will be the showing of the movie Bullied, about a boy who tells his story of bullying and how he survived it all. Now, here's Dennis with a few words of wisdom. A few words of wisdom. Have you ever noticed all the commercials for exercise equipment and health club memberships? We hear a lot about bodybuilding, and we hear a lot about building fame and fortune, too. But what about building character and building principles like honesty, fairness, kindness, and moral strength? Character is, after all, the most important thing we will ever build. The Irish say it like this, a fair character is fair fortune. In other words, if you're a person of character, you're a wealthy person. Why? Because what makes you a person rich is not how much money she has, but how much character they have. Today, remember this. If you want to build a truly rich life, you start now by building the, those character muscles. Something to think about. This is Dennis. Make it a great day or not. The choice is yours. Brought to you by the class of 2017. Thanks for those few words of wisdom, Dennis. Again, this is Riley, and thanks for watching The Scene.